Hello, please watch the following video which will guide you through the assembly steps you need to take to assemble your Oracle iPad kiosk correctly. The first step is to check that you have all of the components correctly. Please refer to the enclosed instruction leaflet and check that all, all parts are, have been supplied. Here we have the M4 fixing kit and the bezel and enclosure. Mount the bezel onto the bracket using the M4 screws by inserting through there and aligning onto the holes on the bracket. Repeat this with a second screw and secure with a nut and a washer on the reverse side. This needs to be repeated for all four screws and once, once tightened, once secured, tighten them using the supplied Allen key. We're now ready to insert the iPad. Make sure that the iPad's import socket is to the left hand side and slide the unit into the enclosure, stopping about halfway. With the iPad inserted halfway, fit the HDMI adapter like so. Before completely inserting the iPad, select the program or application that you want to use by scrolling through and selecting. You won't be able to change this once the iPad is fitted in position, so it's important to sure, ensure that it's set up correctly in advance. Now insert the HDMI cable and iPad power cable into the adapter, like so. Now to secure the iPad in place in the enclosure, insert the locking tabs like so. Number one goes at the back and number two inserts like this. You then insert an M6 screw at the top and tighten in position and repeat that process at the bottom. This will stop the iPad sliding inside the enclosure and keeps it secure inside. The final assembly process is to fit the back cover which hides the cables and ensures the iPad is completely secure. We do this by fitting, feeding this underneath and sliding onto the aluminium locking plates. The cover is oversized so it can slide back and forward over your cables. Make sure the cables are neatly positioned and tucked away inside. You then fit the cover using the four screws provided by inserting into the four corners of the cover plate. Tighten the screws until they are uh, just come in contact with the acrylic. Do not over tighten these screws. Repeat the process on the top two screws and again underneath there are two more screw holes. Secure the screws exactly the same as the top, making sure not to over tighten. The kiosk is supplied with an iPad power cable and a 15 meter HDMI cable which can be run off to your other audio visual equipment. If you do need to remove the HDMI cable, please consult the instructions in the, in the uh, enclosed instruction book. Thank you very much for watching and if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to get in touch at www.imageholders.com.